Hi folks, my name is JC. I'm back here with this Toshiba Serolite C655D. Uh, I would like to show you guys how uh, I can how I do my factory resetting. Uh, first of all, I had already uh, reboot the computer, and um, I don't know if it's showing there. Okay, no, no. I am getting ready to uh, reboot it. Okay, so let's let's do that. It's not that very difficult. It's very simple. You turn off the computer, reboot it, and uh, when it comes on, you have to keep pressing F8. Okay, you're gonna keep keep on pressing F8, and then it's gonna come up. And uh, right there on the top, there will be repair your computer. It is already highlighted, so that's the choice you're gonna take. Take that choice, hit enter. And then you wait. You'll be loading files, and uh, it's going to be kind of a little of a extended period of time. You're going to have to be sitting around for some time, but not the whole time, because once it gets ahead of what's got to do, then and the, it reboots and redo itself and everything else. And it's going to take a long time just uh, installing softwares, but basically you don't have to do anything. So now it's our next step. Uh, I'm gonna try to focus on the screen and uh, uh, you're gonna hit next uh, it's related to uh, to the the name of the person okay, that owns the laptop so you're gonna hit next and uh, I'm sorry if it's not if you can't see well, but here during my uh, review now, I, it's kind of hard for me to see. But I have a small screen that I have to work with. Uh, okay, so uh, you're gonna prefer to do the Toshiba factory resetting. Then it's gonna come, uh, you know, that screen. Uh, that's a very very scary screen. You know, have to be sure of what you're gonna do. But I'm gonna try to close it up so. Uh, Put the camera you know up closer and so you can have a look of what's going on okay so if you are restoring you know, da, 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 are you sure you want to do it then you say yes okay uh, also on this screen now it's very important that you don't miss it don't do erase the hard disk if you do that then you you're gone your computer will be gone your right your right answer is up one that's already clicked so you just hit next and you wait a little bit. Usually it takes a while when you hit it. When you click on it. I don't know why. But it should not be that long. <clears throat> uh, so uh, the computer is thinking about what it's going to do. Okay, so it's coming up again. Another screen. And uh, usually it's the one that's already set. That The one that you have to choose. Recover to out of, out of box state. That's what I want. I don't want the other one. We recover without chain the hard drive and recover customer size partition. Now we're not going to do that. We're going to recover to out of the box, like you got the computer right when you bought it from the factory, or uh, right or from the the store that you bought it from, Best Buy, Walmart, or anything else, or Office Depot. Um, okay, so once you hit that, you just have to wait. I really don't know why it takes some time to come back, but that's the way it does. That's the way we do. So let's go and see what's coming next. There's another screen now. Okay. Go to start the recovery of factory default software. So all partitions will be deleted and you lose all data on the hard drive. No problem. Now, if you had anything that was important, then you should have backed up your, backed up your data. But if you didn't, now was the last chance. So it's gone. So now you're hitting the commands in the computer so that it will uh, restore clean with no data with no files anything won't keep anything you just come fresh like it came from the store when you first bought it all right uh, what else is coming next uh, let me see okay initializing the partition please wait okay so uh, particular particularly the Toshiba laptops they take a long time. They take longer time than other laptops. Some they they're faster than that. For example, Dell is a faster process. The Toshiba laptops they take a long time. I 
think it's because they have so many softwares all right here we go so at this point now what to get there i had to wait like a long time i don't know how long but let's say 30 minutes 40 minutes whatever you have to wait until you see that screen so now it's going to ask you for a name you know the computer name so you're going to put your name on there usually because i resell the computer and i have to uh, to test the computer again i will not sell a computer just on that step because i i need to make sure the computer works so i'm going to put like the name will be owner and that's it so you do some more clicks and uh okay now you're gonna uh do where is your time zone you know in our case we're in easter time and uh you're gonna you know the adjust the, the the hour the time and the date make sure that everything's all right because if something's wrong over there then the computer will not receive updates that will be like a, you can't do it and so you have to to try to do that I have to put the the right times on all right so now it's it it's working the wireless so it's asking me for a password so I enter my password on it and uh, it's doing the you know the updates it's resetting everything and it's uh, adapting to my router so everything's working fine right now and this step is very important because when you do that and the computer does not show up the wireless capabilities you are in trouble the computer is not working it can be a wireless card or it can be something the motherboard and uh, if you if you replace the the wireless card and you still have that problem then you in big 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 problems all right so now all you have to do is just wait a little bit and uh, all right okay chun chun there we go welcome and that welcome will be running for a little bit like i said uh the toshiba laptops they do that eventually they they will be uh, running 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 run that ring will be running forever and uh, but you just have to wait is if you have something else that you have to take care of just go for a walk and then you come back but it shouldn't take that long uh, since the computer got that part okay and uh, it's it's coming so uh, let's just wait in this Toshiba satellite laptop it's it's a very good piece of of electronics usually I like when I buy those Toshibas and uh, if you need a Toshiba laptop just for basic things online and uh, this these models they are very good they're very good they are not so expensive and uh, they are low budget computers you can watch your YouTube videos you can Facebook, you can see emails, and uh, you can do basic things. Now, if you need to to mess to mess to to do or play with videos, editing, and all of this, and you're gonna put more so software on the computer on the computer, you're gonna install more softwares, more software. Then uh, you might be looking into a more powerful machine with more uh rams you know because this one has got what three gigabyte of ram i get i believe i think it's about three gigabyte of ram let me see um i think it is three if i am not mistaken oh there i am again okay oh no this is uh, two gigabytes okay and the processor is an amd v 140 processor and uh, it's a single core okay it's not a dual core processor but even though the you know the process is good uh by the way i'm testing the external screen capability so it shows that it it is responding so my vga port is working there i am again so we're good on that vga port is working and i've already tested all the usb ports I've already tested the the wired uh, wired internet connection. It works. I've tested the headphone uh, jack. It works, and uh, I've already played a, a DVD on it, and also it showed that it works. 
so I am very happy with this purchase and it looks like the computer is going to be fine so uh, there I am with the the cat5 cable and uh, we're going to test the internet now to see if it's working uh, there is the port okay Ethernet work port that's how you say it uh, let's see so now I'm gonna do a close-up so that you can see and if you ever want to see if the computer is working you know both wireless and wired that's what you do you click there on those uh, waves wireless waves and you open the screen and then you open another screen and then you can see that it's working <laughs> well I think uh, got a good deal and the computer looks good works good was able to reinstall itself and uh, for now on, I'm just gonna do uh, just some touch-ups and put it for sale on eBay and the price I'm gonna be selling this computer will be 199 if you're interested in that I'm uh, JC 2009 Nova on eBay okay and uh, don't be afraid to buy on eBay eBay is a safe place to work please subscribe my subscribe my TV my TV